Okay, this is my curly afro bob, the middle part, side part. I am convinced that Her Given Hair is gonna keep sponsoring me until I repeat every single curl that I've done on my channel. And I'm not even complaining because you guys know I love curling my hair. I love spoolies, flexi rods, perm rods, thread, straws. If it can curl hair, I will use it. So today's video, I am gonna use a flexi rod or nine flexi rods rather to curl this, what is this wig called? Curls Always Popping 4x4 Lace Wig. And you can use flexi rods to curl hair about eight different ways, but I'm gonna show you guys the method where you put a bunch of them on one rod. That way it's easier for you to sleep in them if you are doing this on your natural hair. And it's great for people who have longer hair who kind of want to rock a shorter look because it'll compress your hair nicely. And also those of you who may have very thin hair, it's also gonna do that compression and give you the illusion of thicker hair. That's why I like this method. That, and of course, is very easy to do. For the two people who have never heard of Her Given Hair, this is the box that the wig comes in. Open it up and they keep things simple with the wig, a storage bag, and instructions. Back to the wig, there are extra combs and of course, hair details. For some reason, I thought this was a regular closure wig and not a lace closure wig, but this works, especially if you want to part it inside the cap there is a back comb adjustable straps an elastic band a 4x4 lace closure with bleached knots and combs on each side some people prefer co-washing their wigs but i believe in soap and water do what works for you but make sure you wash and detangle in one direction usually i detangle right before styling but I kind of like doing this in the sink. So now I need to do the wash and go and I've already sectioned my hair. I'm going in with my glossy hair polish by Uncle Funky's daughter. I'm spraying generously and brushing out to distribute, then following up with my high definition curl enhancer styling gel by Trey Lux. This is mostly aloe vera, so the cast will be easy to break and I'll be able to transition between styles without having product buildup. I'm using my Maven paddle brush to bear down and define the curls and that's it. Very simple. All I need to do now is let it dry. All right guys, so I am back and I'm wearing the wash and go before fluffing it. I want you to see the before, the during, the after, everything. So what I'm going to do is use my rake comb and just, there's lace here. And I guess that's the good thing about a lace closure because if for whatever reason, if I wanted to part it down the middle and do something here, I could easily do that. So just fluff it. It's really shiny and very lightweight because I use oil as well as the gel. And I'm just combing the roots right now, not worrying too much about the rest of my hair because I don't want to disturb the curls and I can let them fall over time or get frizzier over time. I pull it apart this way and I'll have some defined pieces still. Smooth it down if you want it fluffy. Separate this way if you want it to still be defined. And anywhere where the hair is clumped up, just go ahead and separate in small sections the way you would with a regular roller set. And it's going to just fall into place and be nice. Okay. This is the wash and go and I don't want to let it go, but I still have to do flexi rod. So maybe I should take a picture. Okay. All right guys. So I am ready to put these flexi rods in and I'm using the gray ones. I don't know what size these are because there is no size and the brand is Gabriella. I've never used this brand before, but that's not even a problem because quality doesn't matter when you're curling using this method. So, okay. I'm going to get semicircular sections going around the bangs and they're going to be about an inch deep. But what I'll do is kind of split down the middle first, split down the middle and then go down about an inch. I can't really tell because I'm doing this on my head and then 
make that part all the way to the outside. Now that everything's situated, I am going to go in with my lot of body mousse so that I can wet my hair and make it easier for me to curl it. Also, it's going to reactivate the product I already have in there without causing product buildup. And I'd rather use this than water because water might make it so that my hair doesn't dry on time, but this, this helps speed up drying time. So my first section is going to be as thick as the roller. I'm going to apply some mousse to wet it and reactivate the products already in there. I'm also stretching the section out and wrapping it around the flexi rod. The wrap has to be tight like a bantu knot because I need room for the next section and the next section and the section after that and that and that until the end. Now that I'm done, I'm gonna go ahead and do my bangs and I'm just going to split them down the middle and curl going out. All you do is just open up the flexi rod and start wrapping or unwrapping rather and they should come out. I'm going to go ahead and separate and I got some really good definition. Really good, okay. This is my separated hair. All right, I have a cute little curly bob and I'm going to go ahead and just fluff it so that it can look a little bit better and This is my curly afro bob and this is how I'm gonna wear my wig until I have to wash it again. Of course, over time the curls will drop and I'll probably get this really cute, loose, messy, frizzy look. And then after that I'm gonna wash the hair because it's definitely gonna be time. And really, if you want the middle part, maybe I should put makeup here. I don't know, I don't wanna put makeup though. So if I want, I can always part it down the middle or part it to the side because there is lace in front and because I curled it, there is not going to be a noticeable difference between the bang and the rest of the hair. So let me know, what do you think? Do you prefer a middle part, a bang, a side part? You guys let me know down below. Thank you so much for watching as always. And thank you Hergiven Hair for sponsoring this video. I will talk to you soon.